So guys, I am tired also, so nobody feels sorry for themselves. I busted my ass this morning doing a time trial, so I am wrecked. And um, so we will do it together. We will feel it together, but we'll get it finished, all right? No, no sympathy here. All right, so just have your bands handy. We're not gonna start with them just now, so you don't need your bands on your leg, all right? Um, so we're just kind of warm the body up a little bit. So just bring the hips out right and left, please. Okay, just get the hips a little bit mobile. We don't like you squatting on cold body. Okay. And then we're just going to circle them around, big and slow circles. So you get every point, forward, back, side, and side. Big and slow. Really pushing the bum back with straight legs. And then going forward. Good. And then we're going to go the opposite way. <laughs> Looking at Tom out in the front garden here. He's putting the grass with his little face on more. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. And keep going. <laughs> and we're going to go for one more big one. Good. Okay, and then we're just going to circle the leg, the right leg, out and down. Good. Big circles, keeping the hips forward. And the opposite way, forward and down. Okay. I think there's a few that are going to be a little bit late to class, maybe I think two or three. So we'll give them a chance to jump in also. One more. And we're going to go the opposite way, or the other leg, sorry, so going the opposite way out and down. Good. One more this way, and then we're going to go the opposite way, please. And two more. Okay. Okay, and just from there, just coming up onto your tippy toes, reaching the arms nice and long, and then coming down flat onto your feet, bring the arms down. Inhale to reach up, reach your arms up to the ceiling, come onto your tippy toes, and then come down. Reach up. Anyone that was late to class, make sure you have your runners on, because we're going to do a lot of kind of impact um, exercises. So I'd rather you had some protection on your feet, reaching. So go get runners quickly if you don't have them. And one more, and coming down slowly. Okay, so as I said, so we're just gonna start jogging on the spot, okay? As I said, we're gonna start with some uh, nice kind of warm up exercises. So the first one we're gonna do is bring the heels to the bum, okay? Someone, some of you that roll up me will know this one. So just bring the heels to your backside. Good. For five, four, three, we're going to high knees now, okay? And go. Nice and high, 90 degrees at least. Come on. Good. For three, two, one. Okay, from there, I want nice quick steps, almost like they're sprinting on the spot. Come on, work the arms and go. Lovely, get that heart rate up. Good, first five, four, three, two, one. Next exercise. I want you to crisscross the legs, squat, touch the floor. Swapping direction, forward and back. Right leg in front, left leg in front. Right and left again. You can alternate arms as well if you want. Good. Sorry. Good. Good. Keep going for five, four, three, two, one. Heels to bum. Well done. You can use your arms as well if you want. And you're nearly there. For five, four, three. High knee hit. Drive them up. Try and get a good rhythm going. 
All right, not too slow. Now leaning back. For five, four, three, two, one. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, and sprint. Up and down, nice and quick. Good, work the arms. Short steps. For five, four, three, two, one. Left leg in front, down. Alternate the leg going in front. Good. Good. Keep going. Give me four more. Last two. One. Last time. Heels to bum. Come on. Well done. For five, two, one, high knees. Gotta check up on you, keep going. Keep going. Lovely. For five, four, three, two, one, sprinting on the slot, guys. And go. Really driving the arms. Quick steps. All right, now you might feel like an idiot, but nobody's watching. All right. <laughs> Keep going. Get that heart rate. Come on. Four, five, four, three, two, one. Out. Cross the leg and back. Cross the legs and back, okay? Stick with the same arm going down, guys. Otherwise, you confuse yourself like I just did, okay? You enough to be thinking about. Three more, two, one. Woo! Grab your bands. Warm up done. <laughs> All right. Put the bands around your thighs. Get a sip of water if you need it. Hope you're warmed up. Sweating maybe a little bit. Heart rate beating kind of high. That's what we want. Okay, we're going to split lunge. And then we're going to split lunge with driving the knee. Press ups and then planks with hip rotations. All right, I'm gonna come back here so you can see me. Okay, the wide stance, make sure the band is security around the legs. Drop down onto the right leg in front, left leg behind. Coming up and down. Well done. Nearly 10 minutes gone already. Time flies, guys, when you're enjoying yourselves. Well done. One more. Okay, next one, you're gonna come down, drive the opposite leg. Just stabilize first before you drive, okay? Well done. Where to go? Three, two, and one. Onto your mat, please. Press up. 15 reps. Okay, I want you all trying the full ones for the first five. Come on to your tippy toes, knees off the floor. Give me five full. Then you can drop your knees. Three, two, one. Onto your knees. The last 10 if you want. You need to start practicing, otherwise you'll never do. Don't fear them. You're well able. Five, four, three, two, one. Onto your elbows, we're going plank on the elbows. Okay, 
I want you to bring your right hip down, center, left hip down, center, right, and left. For five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Other side. Bring the other leg in front, please. And drop him down. Good. Sweat is dripping. I think this is the worst yet, lad. Hope I'm not on my own. One more. Okay, from here, drive the knee. Okay. Use the arms. As you drive that standing leg, squeeze the glute to the standing leg. Really contract it. Down to the floor. Okay, press ups again, please. You can go from the knees if you want. Next set, we're going full again. Ready, go. Focus on form. Bring that belly button to your spine. Don't let the waist drop. Stay strong to your core. For five, four, three, two, one. Onto your elbows, please. Onto your toes. And we're gonna rotate the hips slowly and controlled. Alternating sides. Don't dip too low if it feels wrong. Halfway. Three, two, one. Back up to standing, lunging each side. Okay, starting with that front first leg. Right leg in front, dropping down. Gently locking out the front leg. Not too hard. Really pushing into the foot of the front leg, heel down, driving to that heel so you get a deeper contraction in the glute. One more. Stay focused, pick a point, come down, focus, lift, drive. Good. Breathe. Breathe out on up. Three, two, one. Get the mat, guys. Press ups. On five full ones this time. And then onto your knees. Ready? Three, two, one, and go. Four, three, two, one. Onto the knees for the last ten, guys. Get your form right and then go. For five, four, three, two, one. Come up again, guys. Opposite leg, please. Left leg in front, right leg back. Lunge, big squat, good. Gently bring that knee straight, okay? Squeezing the glue the back leg. One more. Okay, drop down, drive the knee. Use your arms, guys. We're really driving that knee, resisting that band. Okay. Last round of these, okay? Press up, please. Onto your knees if you want. 15 in three, two, one, and go. Good. 
for six, five, four, three, two, one. Plank position, please, onto your elbows. Okay, tippy toes, nice straight line. Drop the right hip down, and then the left, and the right, and left. Three, two, one, knees down. Okay, we're moving on to the next exercises. I want you to bring the bands down around your calf, mid calf. Okay, we're going to do side steps. Then we're going to do crabs. I'll uh, show you them when we're doing them. Mountain climbers. And then we are finishing with some abs on that. Um, circuit three rounds okay so come to the end of the room give yourself plenty of leeway going to one way legs are straight guys squeeze the glutes belly button drawn in bring a bit of tension on the band before you begin drive out with one leg bring it back under the hip with the other okay so keeping that space there legs are constantly under the hips or further apart okay and back from four one way, four back. Good. And four, three, two, and one. Okay, bring the bands to your thighs. Come down onto all fours. Okay. Hope you can see me. Lift your knees off the floor. They're under your hip, hands under your shoulders. Walk your right hand out, right leg, left arm comes in, left leg. Okay. We'll do three one way and three the other. Okay. So left hand, left leg, right arm, right leg, left. Doesn't matter, just move them in line. Okay, and we're gonna go again up. Okay, and back. Last. Okay, come down, please. We're coming into mountain climbers. Okay, hands under your shoulders. Nice high plank. Bring the left knee in. Right, left, right. Okay, get a rhythm going. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Five, three, two, one. Come down onto your back. We are doing an ab exercise. Okay. Lie down. In print position, please, with your lower back. All right. Legs and tabletop. Hands behind the head. Take a breath in. We're doing obliques. You're coming from your right side to your left side. Come down and rotate. We don't have a little rest here <laughs> before we go again. Two more. One more. Lovely stuff. Okay, bands around the calves again, please. Um, all right, come to the end of your room, side of your room, give yourself space. Okay, and when you're ready, resistance before you start. Side step, keeping that resistance at all times. So your band is constantly pushing against the legs, glutes are constantly firing. One more up, four, three, two, one. Bring the band around the thighs, please. Okay, grabs. So you're in a leg pull front position. Knees under the hips, hands under your shoulders. Tuck your toes and lift your knees up. Right hand out, right leg, left hand in, left leg, right, 
right, left, left. One more, right, right, left, left. Keep your bum down, left and left. Right, right, good. One more, let's see. Going back up. Keep the bum down, please. One more round. Keep going. Come down. Mountain climbers, please. Actually, gonna come onto my floor. Easier. Go high plank. Okay. And bring the left knee in. Right. Gradually taking up the pace. Okay. Slowly build it up into a running motion. Lovely. For 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Onto your back, guys. And we're staying down. Okay. Well done. Same again. Oblique imprint position. Tabletop with the legs. Hands behind the head. Class is going quick. So we're moving on. Big breath in and rotate. Make sure you're imprinting. If you're not, bring your knees closer to your upper body. Good. Are you with me? I'm nearly finished with this. Give me two more. One more. Lovely stuff. Bring the legs down for a moment. I want you to bring your legs a little bit wider. We're going into bridge position. Hands down by your side, nothing under the head. Please push the hips up and bring your pelvis back to the mat. Okay, four more. Two. One. Good stuff. Okay, take a breath in. On the exhale, imprint your lower back. One leg up. On the other leg up, please. Okay, hands behind the head. Take an inhale here. On the exhale, add breath. Okay, we're going to extend the legs straight. The lower down you go, the harder it is. You need to be able to maintain imprint. Okay, we're going to scissor the legs forward and back. For five, four, three, two, one. Bend the knees into your chest. Take a moment. Bring your legs back into tabletop position. Take an inhale, exhale into ab breath. Elbows back. You shouldn't see your elbows coming forward in your peripheral vision. You shouldn't see your elbows. You should be right back. Chin isn't going to your chest. Keep the face between your chin and your chest. Draw that belly button down as you come up. Have a little look at your stomach as you come up. That's not pushing up. Place your left leg down. Extend your right leg and reach your left arm back. Lower your right leg. Bring it up, push into the band, and reach towards your shin. So left hand going towards your right leg. Right leg is straight. Lower and lift both the arm and the leg. Three more. Two. One. Swap sides, please. Extend the right arm, extend the left leg, hand behind your head, left hand. Take a breath in as you lower your leg and arm. Exhale to hook and reach. Good. Guys, we are nearly finished. Stay with it. This is the easy bit. The hard bit's done. One more. Lovely stuff. 
Okay. Take a breath in. On the exhale, push your hip up off the floor, extending your right leg straight, okay? We're gonna lower and lift that leg to the floor and back to slightly higher than knee, just enough to push into the bend. Keeping the hips level. If they're not level, don't go down too, high, too low or go, go too high. One more. Walk side, please. Extend that leg straight. Lower lift. Four, three, two, one. Okay, take a breath in. And on the exhale, come into imprint position. Bring your legs into table, okay? I want you to bring a bit of space between the knees, okay? And what we're gonna do is we're gonna slowly bring our right heel to the floor, push down, bring it back. We're keeping the space between the legs, okay? So the resistance going out as well as down when you bring the leg down, keeping your imprint, don't lose it. Sorry, Barbara, if your stomach is on fire now after that. Give me two more. All right, two more now. One more. Okay, keep the legs up. Come into an out breath position. I want you to lower your right heel to the floor. Bring your left leg in. Rest your heel down, but drive your knee in towards you and rotate towards that knee. Your right heel is rested on the floor. Now you bring yourself back to center, bring that leg back up the tabletop, lower your left heel towards the floor, rest it down, but push your right knee in and then rotate. Walk center for your body, then release the leg and swap over, rotate. Center your body, bring the leg up. So don't move your leg until your body is back in center. Then you bring your leg out, center the body. Keep going. Push that leg close to you. Come on. One more after this. Knees into your chest, guys. Ah, we're gonna finish off with a little glute activation. We haven't done any, does you? Okay, we're gonna finish on our side. Okay, lying down. Okay, rest your head down. Nice long line. Make sure your ankles, knees, hips are all in one line with your shoulder, okay? They shouldn't be forward of your hip. And lift and lower the straight leg. We're nearly to when you finish, guys. Nine, ten. Okay. From here, just bring your toes towards you. Keep your leg in line with your hip, and I want your toes pointing up towards you, so you're opening the sole of the foot. Bring your hand in front just to stabilize you. You'll see why in a moment. I want you to bring your leg forward, and then point your toes as you bring your leg behind your hip, keeping your leg hip height at all times. Forward the leg, and then bring it back, stabilizing yourself with your arm that's on the floor. Just bring that leg forward, keeping it up at hip height at all times. Two more. One more. Lovely. Bend the knees, please. I want you to elevate your feet. So um, lift both feet off the floor. They're stuck together. Plan position, please. Hips are facing forward. Just check that they're on top of each other as in level and then opening that top leg. So I know when you're doing hip sessions, form is still really important. So it's not all about going hard and doing it wrong. Okay, so still important to keep your form correct. Really important, okay? Otherwise you're end up injured. Three, two, one, relax. 
the legs down. Okay, swap sides, please. And relax down. Okay, lift and lower when you're ready. Being aware of your stomach, so you're not pushing your stomach out. Tuck the ribs, so bring the ribs down, tuck the pelvis a little bit. Abs are active, a little space on the, the waist here, the lower waist. Okay. One, okay. Hand in front, stabilize. Bring your toes towards you, straight line with the leg. You're going to bring it forward as if you're going to kick someone and bring it back. Okay. Forward and back. Going for, far enough back where you feel your glute contracting, okay? And not too far where you feel your back arching. Okay. Pointing the toes towards you as you go forward and then pointing them away as you go back. Lovely. Maybe one more. Okay, bend the knees, ankles together. Last exercise, guys. Well done. Lift the heels, both feet together. Sorry. And open up the top leg again, making sure your pelvis is facing forward and there's no hip rotation at the top. If your band is too strong for these guys, reduce it down. You're not to be gained by going too hard with the band. Only you lose your uh, form and technique with it doing that. Okay, and relax down. Well done, everybody. Okay, so. Just stay lying on the floor <laughs> and breathe. And what I want you to do is just bring the arms out wide and just let your legs fall to the right side of the room. Thanks for coming this morning. It's not easy when the morning is so nice outside. You just want to be out with your family or friends or on your own. <laughs> oh, that'd be nice. <laughs> and soft side to the other side. Let the legs fall down to the floor, nice and relaxed. Breathe. And then from there, just coming back to center, take the band off. Okay, right, and just wrap it around your right foot. Okay, and we'll just do a nice hamstring stretch, keep the other leg bent. Of course, I think, I hope you didn't bother having a shower after your run this morning. No point. <laughs> and relax in. Okay, from there, bend that other leg again. And what I want you to do is bring your knee towards your chest, hold the band, okay? And just focusing on um, strength, oh, oh, sorry, opening the back of the leg. We're gonna hamstring, stretch the lower part of the hamstring, okay? Keeping the upper thigh kind of where it is positioned, okay? Feel a nice stretch coming into the lower hamstring, around the knee. Holding the band securely, slowly kind of let the leg come out a little bit. Make sure you're secure holding the band, please, that you don't let it go. Let your leg goes, bend the knee, knee come back, and then we're just going to bring the leg over our body. I'm going to suspend it a little bit and then straighten it for safety. Find your back. Bend that knee before you bring it back in and swap sides, please. Hamstring stretch first. Oops, another couple of seconds, guys. Go a little deeper if you can. And then from there, 
just bend the knee in towards your chest and I want you to straighten out the leg from there. Focus on opening up the back of the knee. into that and slowly feel a little shake coming into the back of the leg. Stretch. And slowly release, straighten the leg and then slowly bring it outward. You can bring your elbow onto the floor to support yourself too. Good. Bring it back in and then bring it over your body, starting with like a straight leg or bent knee, sorry, and then straighten it out. Uh -huh. And then bend your knee and then bring it back. Okay. Okay. Bring the cell or the right foot onto your lower thigh, please. Opening up that knee and hip area, and then just grab the back of the other thigh area, the left thigh, and pull it up towards your feet. Back thigh. And then bring that leg up. You find kind of a gentle rock to the right and left side. I guess a little small, small rock a little deeper around the two area. Um, okay, onto your knees, please. More stretches, guys. Okay, let's do a little cat pose. <sighs> okay, hands under the shoulders, knees on the hips, relax the spine. Take a breath in and on the exhale, just touch the pelvis and drive your spine towards the ceiling, pushing into the mat and then relax your head a bit. Okay, hold and then we're going to breathe in as we open up that face on the front, your pelvis and your head up together, and then exhale to tuck it. Together, head and pelvis down, and then inhale to bring them away. Opening up that space with you. Take an inhale, expanding the ribs, exhale. Inhale to open. And do two more, guys. Then try and take a big breath, please. You breathe in, coming up. Breathe in, breathe in. And exhale. And inhale, last one. And done. Last stretch, okay? We're going to come with our legs in front. And bring our left foot over our right knee. Bring our right arm over our left leg. Okay, your right elbow is on the outer part of your left knee. Push into that leg, looking over your left shoulder. You have a lovely stretch in or in the hip area. Okay, pick those that are going down the country today. Make sure that you're not too tight traveling. And that if you're going too far, the car a few times on the way down. Okay, and squat over the other leg over, so right foot over your left knee, left arm at the right part of your right knee. Okay, and looking over that shoulder, off the shoulder, looking over that right shoulder, pushing into that right knee with your elbow, and a deeper stretch. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done, everyone. Hi, Tom. Hi. 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 Hi.
だよ。ねえ、どうして、さ、ねえ。Did everyone enjoy that? Oh, he's so cute. Yeah, that was brilliant. Thank you very much, Kai. He's gorgeous. Look at him.